that has remained steadfast and kept the right principles. The company headed toward the world with the right principles. The company that grows with its customers and shares generously. We are Atomy. Atomy, which has been growing ever since its establishment in 2009, is a global multi-level marketing company with a presence across the globe, surpassing 2.2 trillion Korean won in global sales and with a global membership of 15 million. Atomy's number one goal of going beyond customer satisfaction to customer success continues to be its top priority to this day. Providing good quality products at reasonable prices. Atomy's competitiveness lies in the nature of distribution. The absolute quality and absolute price product philosophy that Atomy has practiced since its inception is included in all of its products, such as health functional foods, beauty, living, food, fashion, home appliances, and more. Atomy Hemohim surpassed 2 trillion Korean won in cumulative sales, ranked number one in domestic health functional food exports. With 19 international patents for a single product, it is forging a unique history in the realm of health functional foods. Absolute Skin Care, which has become one of the best-selling cosmetics in the industry, with sales of 100 billion Korean won every year since its launch. Absolute Skin Care received King Sejong Award from the Korean Intellectual Property Office in 2021 for the first time in the cosmetics industry and was selected as world-class product for next generation, selected by Ministry of Trade Industry and Energy in 2022. Atomy practices customer-centered management in all its business activities. And such efforts were recognized by the acquisition of customer-centered management certification for three consecutive years, which is a unique accomplishment in the industry. Starting with the U.S. branch in 2010, Atomy is a global company that opened 26 branches in Asia, South America, Oceania, Europe, etc., with 15 million members worldwide. In 2023, Atomy opened its European branch and has plans for global expansion with a focus on Africa, Latin America, and emerging markets. Atomy's GSGS strategy, which stands for Global Sourcing Global Sales, allows the supply of products that align with the absolute quality and absolute price philosophy through Atomy's global sales network. Atomy's success system, in which the company runs all seminars, allows any member to succeed regardless of individual ability. This is the driving force behind Atomy's distinctive growth. As the next generation broadcaster bridging online and offline realms, the Success Seminar manifests Atomy's vision for members worldwide. It presents a vision of global success that transcends time and space by merging business and culture. The AXE project has been initiated to cultivate global leaders and empower our active members around the world. Atomy is dedicated to providing full support for fostering global business activities. To achieve absolute quality and absolute price and to ensure commitment to quality from its partners, Atomy provides various support measures for partnering companies such as cash payment within one week from delivery, interest-free operating fund loans, and joint quality management systems, among others. These create a culture of accompanied growth. Atomy strives to minimize its environmental impact across all business activities. Through policies like transitioning products to zero plastic and introducing eco-friendly smart packaging solutions with the goal of becoming a global eco-friendly leader.
sharing is a mission that all companies must fulfill. As a result of its consistent annual giving for the last three years, Atomy has secured the number one rank in the distribution industry for donations as a percentage of revenue among the top 500 companies in the country. As a result, it has earned various government awards and certifications, including the Government Award for Sustainable Management, Good Donor Award, Family Friendly Company, and Great Place to Work, Korea. Atomy's executives, employees, partnering companies, and members all practice sharing together to improve the lives of all members of society. Whenever sharing is needed around the world, global branches will be united to support happiness for all. The company that holds true to its principles while creating a new distribution culture. The company expanding globally with the trust of people around the world. The company that dreams of customer success while moving beyond customer satisfaction. The company that cherishes the spirit. We are proud Atomy. Hello, everyone. Welcome to our Global Top English Seminar. I'll be your host for today. I'm your master, Daniel. And once again, I just want to welcome everyone today. And let's just start by saying hi to one another. And so, yeah, it's great to see everyone here today. Uh, thank you all for joining us. And so before we begin, uh, I would like to start by introducing our Quranic translator, all the way from Norway, Salesmaster Kua. Thank you so much. And so, yes, if you do need the uh, Quranic language, make sure you select that at the bottom and uh, switch that over to the right settings. And so before we begin, let's start with our company model. So if you can join along with me. Okay, are you guys ready? Yes. Let's begin. Cherish the spirit, great the vision, follow the faith, follow the faith, serve in humility, Thank you so much. And so today we are uh, blessed to have another great speaker joining us here today, all the way from Korea. Uh, she is a young leader and has grown her uh, Atomy business into a very big, uh, successful big career. And so let us give a big warm round of applause for our Cheryl's master, Songi Choi. Hello, everyone. Hi. Is it good afternoon there? Yeah, it's 2 a.m. here in Korea. Wow. Yeah, I am very excited, though. Uh, uh, thanks for having me here, and I think it's my uh, second or third time to come here. So is there anyone who remember me? <laughs> is there anyone? Wow, thank you so much. Wow, you remember me. Uh, it's my honor. And uh, today, uh, I am going to share about K-Beauty Skincare Know-How with Atomy Products. Uh, so before sharing that, uh, I'd like to uh, show a video. So let's share about it. Uh, wait for me. For many years, France and Japan were regarded as the global cosmetics industry's leaders. South Korea, on the other hand, has recently joined their ranks, becoming renowned for its beauty products and bringing its own brand of innovation and quality to the market. Korean beauty products are now highly in demand all over the world. In addition to electronics and cars, beauty products are one of South Korea's biggest exports. In fact, the United States is the second largest importer of South Korean cosmetics after China, while France is the top importer of Korean cosmetics in Europe with 35%, followed by the United Kingdom, 16%, and Germany, 9%. So, 
How did Korean beauty products become so popular? What's fueling the exponential rise of South Korean beauty products? What's the role of K-pop and K-dramas on the K-beauty industry? And if there is any environmental cost involved in such a rapid growth of K-beauty products? I know you have a lot of questions. Okay, let's start from the beginning. High-tech formulations and trendy ingredients may be a thing of the present, but skin care has always held a special place in Korean culture. The origins of K-beauty can be traced back to centuries ago, from cleansers and moisturizers to powder and eyebrow ink. With the advent of industrialization, Korean beauty products entered the market. Bagabun, Park's powder, the first mass-produced cosmetics item in Korea, was a bestseller from 1916 to 1930. However, in the 1950s, the Korean cosmetics industry was slowed by the Korean War. Later, South Korea banned the sale of foreign products in 1961, and Korean cosmetics industry took off. K-Beauty first rose to fame globally as a result of the success of some of its most iconic products, such as BB creams and cushion compacts, which were quickly adopted by European and American brands eager to appeal to Asian consumers. BB cream, which was previously only available in China, first appeared on American shelves in 2011, and by 2014, the U.S. market for BB cream had grown to $164 million. At the same time, major Korean brands heavily invested on the success of these products to make a name for themselves, while skillfully utilizing their international recognition. Moreover, K-Beauty prioritizes skincare while also ensuring that their products are fashionable and affordable, which made them highly popular globally. K-Beauty is to the cosmetics industry what K-pop is to the music industry. Now, let's take a look at some stats. South Korea currently has between 1,800 and 2,000 beauty brands, which is a large number for such a small country. It is a major manufacturing powerhouse. It manufactures cosmetics for export to countries such as the United States and Europe. In addition, over a four-year period, South Korea increased its cosmetic production from 8.5 billion to 13 billion won. And the skincare craze is keeping the country in the news for all the right reasons. According to the Korean Pharmaceutical Traders Association, South Korea exported more beauty products, $1.067 billion, than it imported, $978 million, for the first time in 2014. The market for K-beauty products was worth $10.2 billion in 2019, while $10.3 billion in 2020, and is expected to reach $13.9 billion by 2027 growing at an average growth rate of 9% from 2021 to 2027. Asia Pacific is one of the most important regions in the market, accounting for roughly 70% of total K-beauty market share in 2019. So, what factors have propelled South Korea to the forefront of this field so quickly? Innovation and quality. In Korean culture, appearance and beauty are extremely important, to the point where they can have a significant impact on the hiring process and a candidate's chances of landing a job. As a result, beauty products and surgeries that help people achieve the right look are in high demand. Customers are very knowledgeable about cosmetics products and have very high standards in South Korean culture, so cosmetics companies are under pressure to produce the best merchandise. This is one of the reasons why K-Beauty is so innovative constantly researching and developing new products to stay ahead of the competition. In fact, this innovation, quality, and price has given them an edge in the global market. Wellness and health are heavily emphasized in Korean beauty products. Therefore, natural ingredients are used to make the products, which are clearly labeled on the packaging. Korean beauty brands are constantly evolving to incorporate new technologies, particularly in terms of raw materials. Some of the unusual ingredients used in K-Beauty products include snail slime, bee venom, starfish extract, pig collagen, and morphing masks. Increased inclination of consumers towards natural products and technological advancements in the skincare industry are the key market trends that are driving the growth of K-Beauty in the global market. The Korean wave, or Hallyu, is another important factor to consider. This refers to the global spread of South Korean pop culture and its impact on other countries. The popularity of South Korean entertainment, particularly TV shows and Korean pop music, as well as the movies and literature, have shaped the K-beauty craze. K-pop, as well as K-dramas and other cultural exports, 
has grown in popularity with international audiences in recent years. Celebrity endorsements carry a lot of weight, and they're a big driver of cosmetic sales. Everyone wants to use the same products as their favorite celebrities to achieve the same look. With the Korean wave, this influence is spreading around the world, helping to drive global sales of South Korean cosmetics. K-Beauty products include not only cosmetics for women, but also cosmetics for men. As a result, new product launches for men's cosmetics that target and help their skin issues fuel the market's growth. Korean men are also driving the cosmetics market in South Korea, spending significantly more on cosmetics per person than men in some other country. Many men, in addition to skincare and makeup, receive regular beauty treatments. And the men's cosmetics industry is also fueled by pop music and drama idols. While men's beauty products are taking longer to gain traction in the West, the Korean wave is having an impact on the outside market. The influence of social media is also one of the most important factors in the global popularity of K-beauty products. Advertisements and video tutorials on social media platforms like Facebook and Instagram have had a huge impact on viewers, propelling the K-beauty market forward. Colorful packaging, as well as reviews and demonstrations on Instagram and YouTube have piqued consumers' interest. Moreover, through social media, consumers around the world are becoming more aware of the benefits and uniqueness of K-Beauty products, creating a huge opportunity for the growth of K-Beauty products. Individuals are actually spending money on beauty products made in South Korea, influenced by their favorite beauty bloggers. As a result, the market becomes more appealing and promising for the future of the Korean beauty products industry. All right, we will watch until uh, now. So I will share the screen. Wait for a while, please. All right, how do you feel about the video? <laughs> do you understand about K-Beauty now? Why is it going global? <laughs> okay, is there anyone who wants to make your skin healthy and glow? Please raise up your hand. I believe that everyone wants. Yeah, everyone wants. Okay, thank you. Uh, do you know why K-Beauty is getting so popular worldwide like this? <laughs> uh, I believe that it's because... Uh, our uh, K Korean beauty is popular because of its innovative and quality products like the video set. For a very long time, traditional makeup brands were purely focused on color. But now they see that consumers are far more educated about skincare and that is one of K-beauty impacts on cosmetic industry. The people are getting aware of the importance of skincare and the term Korean glass skin is now well known with it. The glass skin is a skin ideal in Korea, and it means skin that looks crystal clear, poreless, translucent, and luminous like a piece of glass. So let's learn how to get Korean glass skin. The so cleansing is the key to getting Korean glass skin. So yeah, we are going to start with cleansing. Most people with good skin always say uh, their secret of the skin is cleansing. So I know some of you might feel like, oh, it's so basic. <laughs> I already know how to cleanse. Uh, but truth is, a lot of people are doing their cleansing wrong or either uh, they don't really know how to choose the right cleanser. So probably a lot of you might be likely to choose uh, to use a very for me, very satisfying cleanser that gives you uh, that squeaky clean feeling, uh, like that pore tightening, you know, uh, you know what I'm saying? So, but in fact, uh, by using those foaming cleansers, you're actually making your skin more vulnerable uh, to the outside world. So a lot oilier and a lot more acne prone skin. Uh, so, if you guys are using that type of cleanser, I highly suggest you to take it away from the bathroom or either just apply on your body to use it as a body wash. But 
never use it on your face, please. Okay, uh, then let's find out what causes skin problem. If your skin goes through stress, it can become more vulnerable, which can lead to premature aging or more inflammation. So be aware of it. The first thing that makes your skin stressed out is pollutants, such as dirt and fine dust. Imagine that you are mixing the dirt and skincare products on your face because you haven't cleansed well. That is so terrible. The dirt and fine dust are major cause of clogged pores, and clogged pores cause the breakouts on your skin. Secondly, let's talk about UV rays. UV rays associate with skin aging, photo aging, and sun damage. Also, ultraviolet radiation is known as a human carcinogen, which means that it's going to develop melanoma or no melanoma skin cancer of the surface of the skin. So if you expose yourself to strong sunlight for a long time, the skin cancer will be possibly shown much later in your life. That's why we need to apply sunscreen every day. Sunscreen does help preventing skin cancer. But even though you apply sunscreen for sun protection, it can be stressful to your skin if they remain on your skin because of wrong cleansing. That's the reason uh, makeup residues are the third cause of skin problem. People are using various kinds of sunscreens, foundations, and color makeups. And those residues can cause clogged pores, pimples, and hyperpigmentation. Accordingly, we need double cleansing and deep cleansing. Double cleansing is to remove all makeup residues and deep cleansing is to take care of impurities in the pores and dead skin cells. So, all right, then now I'm going to talk about double cleansing. Like I said, it is for removing all makeup residues, including sunscreen. So please, uh, men should do double cleansing as well if you use sunscreen. You might have heard about this a lot, right? but many of you don't know what double cleansing means exactly. In the past, I thought that double cleansing is washing off my face one after uh, the other with hot and cold water. So hot water and cold water, hot water and cold water. I was thinking like that. Double cleansing is like using uh, two different temperature of water, but actually it's not, you know? So it was totally wrong. So is there anyone who thinks like me? Anyone? Oh, double cleansing is using like hot and cold water. Uh, yeah, I, I, I don't see anyone raise up for now. So, okay, I will tell you what double cleansing is. So a lot of your makeup and sunscreen, uh, it has oil components in it. And oil gets drowned out by oil. So that's why you need to wash your face or remove your makeup with oil flow over cleansers. A face cleanser alone is not enough to wash off makeup residues. After you do that, you have to follow up by using a water-based cleansers. And that is actually known as the double cleansing method. A double cleanse, particularly in the evening, is a great method to remove makeup, oil, and dirt without scrubbing. So in the evening, I really, really dedicate my time and effort to uh, thoroughly cleansing off my makeup and balancing the pH level. If you don't necessarily wear any makeup, you can dump right into the water-based cleanser. But you need to look for something that's labeled as low pH, mild, gentle, hydrating, or even morning cleansers uh, and those are great consistency cleansers. Those low pH cleansers generally come in a very clear gel consistency rather than a creamy, foamy consistency. So I highly suggest that when you do your cleansing, you must be gentle and use mild cleansers. A lot of people tend to love the squeaky clean filling and the pore tightening filling uh, after cleansing their face, uh, thinking 
uh, all impurities are cleansed off and all, uh, all of their oil and sebum is gone. So in fact, it's probably too gone, you know, that uh, pulling and pore tightening is the stripping sensation uh, is a very correct indicator that you, your skin might be micro cracked. And all the bacteria uh, that were sitting on top of the skin, if your skin is micro cracked, it's going to fall through and penetrate inside your skin. Uh, meaning that you will wake up with a breakout and you will become more acne prone skin because you're going to habitate all the bacteria inside your skin. So if our skin is micro cracked like this, uh, our, our natural moisture water content that we have inside our skin is going to evaporate through the crack and go into the air seriously. Sorry. So this is why you want to use a low pH, mild and gentle cleanser to protect that outer layer of the skin. And that layer is called acid mantle. It's made out of sweat, sebum, and natural oil. Uh, I know it sounds uh, gross, uh, but it actually is a very good guy. Uh, it's a protective barrier. It's like a soldier is the first defense mechanism that fights away all the bacteria from coming down to the skin and the harsh chemicals and the pollutants. So don't forget to wash first with an oil-based cleanser as a first cleanser, uh, then follow with a gentle water-based cleanser as a second cleanser. The Atomy also has many kinds of cleansers. We have a deep cleanser, mild cleansing water, cleansing oil, and cleansing wipes. They are oil-based first cleanser. And also, we have very gentle and mild water-based second cleansers. You can pick them up depending on your skin type and skin conditions. Deep cleansing, uh, our deep cleansing facials are a multi-step skin treatment that can include exfoliation, face mask, cleansing, a facial massage, steam, and a variety of creams and lotions. So especially deep cleansing is mainly about refining pores and exfoliation. Uh, there are a variety of facials that are chosen depending on your specific skin issues and skin type. Some are good for skin firming, uh, others are great for removing dead skin and revealing a fresh layer. And uh, still others focus on solving a particular skin condition or treating problem, uh, problem areas. So I will recommend a deep cleansing frequency based on your skin analysis. While it's a standard to recommend a facial every four to six weeks, I recommend a different schedule based on your individual skin needs or concerns. In many cases, multiple treatments are needed to accomplish the desired skincare goals. Generally, a series of deep, clean, uh, deep cleaning facials, as well as a daily skincare regimen designed for your skin type is recommended for producting ideal results. So, Evening care set is a kind of perfect uh, cleansing product, you know. So it's my one of my favorite in Atomy skincare line. I think you, all of you, 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 you should have used this product, right? You, you must, you, you must use this product if you are doing Atomy business. If you are not using this product, I think. Uh, you are a beginner of this business or you are not ready to succeed in this business, I think, because uh, this evening care full set makes our skin uh, literally a glass skin. So this is the first basic product, you know. So using deep cleanser is the first cleanser, you know, and foam cleanser, the second cleanser. And also you should... Uh, deep cleanser helps deep cleansing, like refining your pores, and then pulling gel uh, helps exfoliation. And you know what? Peel off mask 
it's uh makes your skin elasticity better much better and your uh, pores will be uh your enlarged pores can be uh become smaller so it could be tightened so i recommend this product because they are the first step of atomic products especially in skincare area so next have you ever heard about seven skin method or 10 step skincare routine? They are originated from K-beauty, you know? So after cleansing, you should use multiple layers of hydrating products for a, a, an instant boost of hydration. Uh, start with toner. Face toners used uh, used to, uh, face toners usually, um, they were estrogen before, but today's toners are hydrating, not estrogen. Uh, besides, the new class of toners maintains your skin's pH balance. So, and then you should use essence, serum, or ampoule to hydrate your skin. They are highly concentrated with active ingredients uh, that focus on brightening, hydrating, and nourishing the skin. So they also correct your skin texture and reduce signs of aging. That's good, right? So uh, one of the best item for me actually is Ampil, like a, uh, amongst like a toner, essence, serum, lotion, nutrition cream, hydration cream, milk. There are so many skincare products, but one of the best is Ampil because this is the most highly concentrated one and it's, uh, it contains uh, high uh, active ingredients. So I really love Ampule, you know? So my one of my favorite in Atomy is Blue Bottle Ampule, you know, active, uh, uh, absolute cell active skincare Ampule, you know? That's my favorite. Anyways, uh, never forget to apply uh, your moisture, uh, moisturizer, such as nutrition cream or lotion. Uh, after essence or serum or ampule. Moisturizing is essential to lock in the active ingredients and in hydration uh, applied in previous steps. So you should lock after using these kind of products, okay? So uh, that's why Atomy sells skincare products as a set. Of course, we are selling individual items, but I recommend you to use a full set if you want to experience Korean skincare routine. In Atomy, we have a variety of skincare sets invented by using specialized technologies. You can choose a product line depending on your skin type and skin concerns. So I want to tell you my favorite Eflos skincare set. Uh, it is the Atomy's uh, premium skincare line. It received three technology awards, IR52 Changyangshil Award, NEP Award, and King Sejong Award. And it was also chosen as one of the next world-class products by Korean government. King Sejong Award is the grand prize of Patent Technology Award uh, from the Korean Intellectual Property Office, HIPPO. So Atomy won this award and it is very famous amongst Korean engineers and workers in the R&D department. In a technology field, King Sejong Award is considered as a reliable and reputable award. So it's the greatest honor to win the prize because it is given to the best technology survived from the competition amongst at least 100,000 technologies of patents uh, registered every year from all different kinds of industries. It's very nice award, you know? It's, it's literally grand prize. The so Atomy won this one. Atomy is the first and only one who have got this award in the cosmetic industry ever in Korea. So do you wanna see the effect of Atomy products? It's an award, but some people will not sure, uh, will not be sure about, oh, even though, we have many prizes, but I am not sure about the effect. You will think like that. So I will show you that. 
<laughs> As you can see the pictures on the screen, uh, I had a darker and more dark skin and my skin was uneven and very flaky. The pictures were taken 13 years ago and my skin was not that good like my skin I have now actually. So since I took the Korean skincare routine with every product, such as evening care set and the previous version of the famous uh, previous version of the famous skincare set, uh, my skin became healthier, smoother, and brighter. The people around me started asking me what kinds of skincare products I was using. I had used uh, so many popular brand products such as IOP. Hera, Misha, Innisfree, Lancome, Chanel, Estee Lauder, SK2, and so on. But my skin showed not much improvement with them. Only after using Atomy products and uh, studying more about skincare, my skin showed apparent changes. So I am so happy to share about the knowledge I studied and my experiences. So do you feel the difference between the pictures? And do you feel the difference between my uh, face now, my skin now? Actually, it's 2 a.m. here, so I did not apply any, uh, anything for now. I only apply like moisturizers and I didn't apply any cushion or BB cream, uh, nothing. But, you know, uh, after using Atomy skincare product, you know what? Your skin become glow, you know, you know that, right? So I will show different evidence. It's not just me. Uh, she's one of my partners. And uh, when I first met her, her skin was like this. She, uh, okay, let me show you. Larger. See, she has like uh, skin breakouts, a lot of breakouts. And uh, could you feel this, her skin uh, texture is very uneven? Can you feel that? So uh, first time when I met her, her skin was like this. But after she started uh, taking care of her skin with Atomy products, her skin changed like this. So it's glowing, literally glowing, you know. And can you find breakouts? No. And skin became even. The texture looks glow and luminous and looks very healthier, right? And uh, she's one of my client, uh, customers. And she, uh, I usually offer a facial treatment to my co uh, consumers when I first met them. Uh, so uh, it was the first time to see her. So I offer a facial treatment to her. And before she uh, apply absolute and before she uh, peel off her peel off mask, uh, you can see the difference. Uh, after applying peel off mask, we wait and we peel off and she apply absolute skincare with EP Skin Booster. Can you feel the change? I mean, the difference? Yeah, it's glowing, you know. And you know what? If you have hyperpigmentation like this, if you give more hydration and more nutri nutrient uh, nutrition on into your skin, then the hyperpigmentation becomes uh, lesser, you know, uh, it's getting uh, lesser and lesser. And next, okay. Can you see the difference before taking our facial treatment and after taking our facial treatments? Her uh, skin looks very dry. And uh, you, you can see the wrinkles is more uh, apparent, you know. But after giving hydration into her skin, it's glowing and wrinkles a little bit gone, right? It's gone. And it's the same here. Can you see the wrinkles here? And you can compare the wrinkles around here in the square round and also her fine lines and her tone. 
Can you feel the difference? This is just one facial treatment makes her skin look like this. Giving hydration and like exfoliation and using peel off mask, using EP Skin Booster. It's, you know, uh, skin, EP Skin Booster uh, makes your skin much elastic. So it will goes up. Your skin, your facial lines change, you know. So it will change if, if you use with EP Skin Booster. So it's like that. And also here, she shows a very, uh, how can I say, obvious chains rather than other people. Uh, before she using, uh, uh, before this one is like before using peel off mask and after using peel off mask and then after applying Aflo skincare set. So let's see. You can compare the wrinkles here and also wrinkles. Can you can you see the difference? And wrinkles, eye wrinkles, you can compare eye wrinkles and eye wrinkles. So it's glowing, you know. See? And the navigatorial uh, lines, you know, here. So it changes. Like I said, it's just one try of our skincare products. One try. And it shows obvious difference. So that's why I believe in Atomy products. I cannot, uh, uh, I cannot love with our products. I mean, uh, there's no way uh, only loving our products, you know. Yeah, and uh, she's my African consumer. And after using Pure Off Mask, her pores are tightened. And also, uh, this guy is my uh, brother line uh, man. And he used Dark Spot Corrector, Absolute Snow. And before he used this one, he has many Dark Spots around. But after using uh, Dark Spot Corrector, like uh, four months using, uh, as you can see, his dark spots are all gone. So it's so wonderful. Our products are so just wonderful, you know. So you should believe our products. Can you believe? Okay. And uh, so I uh, shared about two uh, secrets. The first one, cleansing. The second one, the hydrating and moisturizing by layering. So using a uh, toner, essence, or ample, uh, you can pick one or two or three. Anyways, and then you have to use moisturizer such as nutrition cream or lotion. So you should block, uh, you should moisturize your skin. So hydration and moisturize, uh, moisturization you need to uh, do both of them, okay? You need both. Uh, and this is uh, the last secret of K-Beauty, you know. If you are using your products during the day, uh, sunscreen will be your finer step. Sunscreen is the most important part of the skincare regimen, especially in K-Beauty, to prevent signs of aging and sun damage. So I already mentioned it briefly, but I need to talk more because it's so important. Why is sunscreen so important? <laughs> so it's because it is related to our skin aging. Our skin changes every time throughout our lives. And usually the changes are not welcome to us. Uh, welcome to us. You will lose your elasticity and you will get Sagging, hyperpigmentation, dehydration, <laughs> enlarged pores, wrinkles, etc., etc. So we always want to delay our aging process. So do you want to be like her, or do you want to be like her? <laughs> so if your skin getting younger and younger, you know, your skin becomes glow, healthier because of like cell turnover, you know. 
if cell turnover is uh, uh, the cell turnover is occurring, it, it is generating new cells every day, but it's getting slower and slower. And your skin aging. So you will get wrinkles and you will get hyperpigmentation. But actually, if you want to delay this kind of aging process, Atomy products can solve the problem, you know? So, you know, Absolute Skincare Set is called, you know, de-aging product. It is not anti-aging. You know the difference between anti-aging and de-aging? So I usually say like, uh, like this, think about the car. It's going this way. No, okay, this way. It's going this way. So you, your time is going this way. So your skin is aging like this. But actually, you can break, right? You can uh, use a break and you can stop or slow down it. But actually, that's anti-aging. But if you can go reverse, how do you feel that? You can go reverse. That's de-aging. So anti-aging is stopping or slowing down. De-aging is going reverse. So your aging process going this way. So you can uh, take that again. You will take the younger skin again when you use absolute skincare. So that's why it's my favorite, you know? Okay. Uh, anyways, actually, it's for about uh, sunscreen. So uh, I will explain more. Uh, let's look at the picture. It is the picture of 63-year-old lady. So I don't think she looks 63 years old. Uh, she looks pretty younger than that, doesn't she? Right? And there is another picture here. How do you think about her? She has much darker skin. A lot of dark spots all over her face and deep wrinkles. Their skin condition is unbelievably different, but they are identical twins. So why is it happening? How this identical twins skin looks like this? Here's the different picture. The guy is 69 years old. Just look at uh, look uh, his skin and compare with this guy. Hi, how old do you think he is? Can you guess? Who looks younger? The first guy, the second guy? You can type to the chat room. <laughs> yeah, okay. You can type. Uh, I think, well, it's very easy. And, you know, um, I think it's very easy. Uh, the second guy's skin is too much sagging and his wrinkles just look like cracked uh, land, you know, the cracked one. So, uh, I will share this one. Actually, they're the same person. His name is Bill, a delivery truck driver who never worn sunscreen uh, throughout his career. So you may also notice the right side is aged about 20 years beyond the left side. Uh, that is because the UV rays coming through the windows of his truck day in and day out. That causes more serious photo aging on his right side. So photo aging. If you can prevent that one, you can slow down your aging. And also, if you, plus there, if you use Apple Skincare Set, you can make it much fasterly reverse, right? You can go reverse very fast with two, uh, this K-Beauty know how you know? Uh, some rays are divided into uh, infrared invisible rays and ultraviolet radiation according to their wavelengths. Uh, it's very uh, complicated, but I will uh, make it very short. So infrared and ultraviolet radiations are radiant energy uh, that's invisible to human eyes. So uh, 
UV light, short for uh, uh, UV light is a type of electromagnetic radiation uh, from the sun all the way to the earth. So actually it's reacting to our skin a lot. Uh, I'll explain about UV rays very shortly. Uh, there's three types of UV rays, uh, UV, A, B, C. So, uh, uh, but usually UVC cannot uh, penetrate under ozone because ozone can prevent them. Uh, so we have to uh, be sure about UVA and UVB because we are uh, usually exposed to these two UV rays. So UVA ages skin and UVB burns the skin. So UVA rays penetrate skin more deeply than UVB rays. Uh, reaching through the epidermis. Uh, it means the top layer of our skin um, and, uh, and into the dermis, the middle layer of our skin. So they are what help us tan, but they are also what causes signs of aging, like wrinkles and fine lines. So I hate that. <laughs> Anyways, so, you know, uh, we need to uh, get vitamin D from uh, the sun rays, but actually if you're too much exposure, uh, exposed to the sun rays, like UV rays, uh, it can also cause skin cancers, you know. So either UVA and UVB and also UVC, uh, all of them can cause skin cancer. That's why we must use sunscreen every day, like I said. So I am like saying using sunscreen every day. This is my third time, you know, <laughs> can you remember that? Why I say like this? Because it's important. Skin cancer cannot come today. It will come very later. Suddenly, when you in your like 30s, 40s, 50s, 60s, 70s, 80s, we don't know when it will come. So you have to prevent it. The sunscreen helps protect you from overexposure to the sun's damaging rays. Uh, and it can contribute to fine lines and wrinkles, signs of premature aging and skin cancer, like I said. So they are very, uh, I think, compared to Korea, uh, you are living in Canada, right? Uh, Canada, right? I think Canada's sun rays will be stronger than Korea, I think. Is it right? You know, sunshine. So I think UV rays will stronger than Korea because you, I'm not sure, but uh, you know what? Actually, uh, uh, it's getting gray. The sky is getting gray in Korea <laughs> recently. Uh, yeah, we are, uh, yeah, I don't know why, but you know, I think it's too uh, around our, uh, including Korea. Uh, many Asian countries are already too much, uh, how can I say, developed. Uh, we, they have many factories. So I think uh, the air pollution is serious, but you know, the because of the dirt, the UV rays is not that strong, I think. Uh, it's a kind of uh, good thing, but uh, I'd rather take the UV rays because I can protect with uh, sunscreen, but air pollution is uh, getting serious. That's very sad. Yeah, anyways, um, so, so we have to, apply sunscreen like i said it's uh and uh there are two types of uh, sunscreen types actually it's a three because there is physical chemical and mixed one so you can pick mm, uh these types of sunscreen when you want and uh i will tell you about uh the uh two different types of sunscreens okay physical sunscreen is known as mineral sunscreen uh, and actually, this sunscreen is getting popular nowadays. Uh, but before, people liked uh, people liked not physical. Sorry, it's confusing. Chemical sunscreens because chemical sunscreens uh, texture was very soft and it was very easy to apply. But uh, nowadays, technologies are getting better and better. So many people are using very soft mineral sunscreens. Uh, and uh, it is uh, these two types of sunscreens uh, can be differentiated uh, through how they block rays. 
So mineral sunscreens sit on the surface of your skin and act as a shield, while chemical sunscreens sink into your skin and act more like a sponge. So physical sunscreen is more common. Uh, I mean, chemical sunscreen uh, partially absorbs into skin and prevents UV damage through a chemical reaction. Atomy also has many sunscreen lines, as you can see. So we have all ranges of sunscreen. So you can select and use the type you want. We have bar type. It's a stick type, actually. And this one is 100% ke well, chemical sunscreen. And this one is 100% physical sunscreen. So you can use stick type or you can use a cushion type. And also there is a very normal types of sunscreens here. So we have mixed one. And also we have mineral sunscreen here. But actually, you know, mineral sunscreen's texture, like I said, usually is more mm, uh, thick, thicker than chemical sunscreen. So actually texture is much smoother uh, uh, with chemical sunscreens. But, you know, the mineral sunscreen is really mild. So usually uh, this, this CeraBebe is for babies. So if you want to use sunscreen onto your child, then you'd better use mineral sunscreens. And also if you have very sensitive skin, then I recommend uh, mineral sunscreen as well. And recently, mm, in Korea, the new product, Fresh Sun Lotion, has just released uh, in this month. So it's a 100% physical sunscreen, but it is very smooth and lightweight. I was really surprised because I have never experienced a mineral sunscreen like this. It's very smooth. And uh, it, it's a kind of tone-up sun lotion. Uh, so I am sure that all of you will fall in love with this product once you try this one. So, well, it's all about I prepared for today. So uh, I hope that you like the know-how and Atomy product throughout the lecture. So do you remember the three keywords? The K-Beauty know-how, but it is in Atomy products, right? So firstly, you have to do right cleansing. And second, you have to use hydrating and moisturizing products by layering. Not just one, using one toner, we're just using essence. Uh, they have their role. So at least you do better use three items. So toner type, serum type, and cream type. So uh, you can layer using that kind of product, but I recommend a set to use. And third one, the last one, apply sunscreen every day to prevent aging, right? So uh, I hope that it was helpful to you. And I really liked to, to share about uh, Atomy skincare products today. Thank you for listening. Thank you so much for that amazing beauty class from our Sharon Rose Master. Uh, if you can give another round of applause for our amazing uh, lecturer. I really definitely enjoyed that as well as much. I hope that you also enjoyed it as well. Uh, yeah, so there's a lot to unpack, especially uh, with that, uh, you know, it's just, just pretty much a very straightforward formula for building your skin. But you can truly trust with Atomy's amazing high quality products, right? You definitely will know that you can't go wrong whenever you try using Atomy. Uh, and not only that, but on the benefit is that you also get to save some money while doing so, right? And so it's a win-win in both sides. And then not on top of that, you also make income through it through doing the Atomy business. Right? So Atomy has truly given us the ultimate, I think, tool for not only enhancing our beauty and outliving our success, but building a lasting you know, stream of revenue for our future. And so once again, thank you so much for 
our uh, amazing lecturer, especially when it's around like 2, 3 a.m. there and spending her time, uh, giving her time to uh, speak to us here today. And so once again, thank you all for joining us. We're just going to end it off with our company motto, and then we'll just take a quick picture. Uh, so uh, please stay around for that. So if you can join me for the company uh, motto. Then, yeah, ah, yes. So Oh, I have okay. Is it okay? Ah, yes, please. Okay. okay. Uh, thank you for, you know, giving us, you know, great lecture for, you know, Songi Choi. Yeah. I love your skin. It's glowing, glowing. Oh, my God. Even though 2 or 3 a.m. right now. Yeah. Uh, I have a question. Uh, you said today we have a new version of, you know, uh, sun cream. The This month is released, right? So that sunscreen is, uh, you said, the physical sunscreen. So can we uh, use for the, our face or body or all, only body? or uh, all, Everywhere. Only, it's everywhere. for uh, face and body. Uh, so and body. the amount is larger than uh, the other sunscreens of Atomy. So it, it's uh, 180 milliliters. So you know uh, it's three times bigger than uh, the normal Atomy sunscreen. So it contains a lot of amounts. And even though it's a mineral sunscreen, actually it's formula. I mean, it's technology, it, uh, it's so good. So actually uh, on our uh, website, it says like you can easily uh, cleanse up them so because it is sun lotion. So its texture is just like a lotion and very lightweight and easily removed. So actually, if you are using sunscreen, uh, I said like, oh, you need to double cleanse. I said like that. But actually, if you use sun lotion uh, with foam cleanser, it can be easily removed. So it says like that. So very uh, easy to move on your face to the, uh, the from the top to the bottom everywhere. OK, OK, thank you. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much. OK, thank you. Okay, okay, thank you so much. If you guys have uh, one more question, just uh, let us know. Do you have any question or uh, any comment for her? No, nobody? How about James Chung? <laughs> A very good presentation. Um, I don't know. I I, um, I use the products and um, now I know exactly what they do. But um, I was a science major in college. So knowing the science of the toners and you know, all the different things between acidic and things like that. I understand more of what we're doing. So it makes me more curious and want to know more. So thank you for helping me become more curious today. Okay, okay, thank you. Okay, Daniel, you, you can close right now. Okay, thank you so much. Yeah, and so uh, we're just going to end it off with our company Moro. And so you can join us for that. Okay, yeah, and so if you can open up your mics and follow along, are you guys ready? Yeah. Yep. Let's begin. Yeah. Cherish the spirit. Break the vision. Thank you so much. Thank so we'll just take a picture. Thank you. Uh, if you want to open up your and join us. Yeah, join us, please. One, two, three. Thank you. Perfect. Thank you so much. Okay. Thank you so much. Thank, thank you so much, Sharon's Master, for that thank lecture. You and thank you all for joining us. See you all next week. Thank you. Have a good day. Thank you.